see here. Gear. Oh, I just dropped the M9 mag, and there's one down here. Wow. And a lot of soda cans in a map. I'm gonna leave all that. It's a monkey zombie. How you doing? How you doing? How you doing? Oh, I thought I saw an animal, but it wasn't one. It was a bush. It looked like one from here, but same shape of one. I heard there are vehicles being here as well. There is a UA, uh, UA, yeah, UAZ. Not a UFO, a UAZ. Seems really strange that the wire fencing can be right there. It's not even blocking anything, really. Hmm. There are ways to get around them, but they are at the tower that I found. I don't see anything in the back. I don't see anything right there either. There are, instead of um, holding shift the whole entire time, you can double tap shift, which will put you in a, a walking, um, what do you call it, a walk run toggle. If you double tap it, you'll actually will walk. If you double tap it again, they'll put you in the run. More of a, the steady jog, so you have to double tap W to sprint, so it's more of a, I guess you would consider it a run, like a gentle run jog combo. It would be really weird if a helicopter landed, like, right now. Like, out of nowhere, somebody was decided, Oh, oh, hey, I'll stop at the airfield and refuel real quick. And just show it up. It'd be kind of cool, actually. I thought I heard flies. It's not a good sign, either. Mm. So how far have you guys been... Staying alive. What's what's your maximum days that you've been alive so far? Have you have you uh, made it past day one, day two, maybe day three? According, I'm not sure if it's just because of the servers have been messed up, but we're not beating back the zombie overlords right now. They've taken over Earth. Yeah, holy cow! This place is really defended. So there is a possibility of finding some serious gear here. I think it, it went from 4 hours and 39 minutes down to 29. It's a huge, 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 massive difference. It's like an hour, a couple hours. 4 hours is a big decrease. We have to fight back our zombie overlords before they finally take over. If there is a wire fence to get at the ladder, I'll show you how to get around it real quick. It's that predator again. Seriously, it's stalking me. He was on the other side of the fence. It wouldn't surprise me if there was, like, predators on here somewhere. So camouflage and you can't see him, so it'd be like, well, I can't see the, the predator, but it would make sense because it is kind of like the end of the world and they'd be here to hunt the most advanced, the most, you know, best survivors on here to get their heads and whatnot. Almost here, it's my last stop. I thought that fence was a human right there. <sighs> Standing up, oh my gosh. Alright, go on and go inside. Get out of this rain, it could dry off a little bit, maybe there'll be a tower in here. I really don't have any hair, it looks shaved to be honest, so... I'm looking for some ammo as well. Yes, it's an AKM magazine. Alright, going up. I got killed here last time. Last time as I came here, I ended up getting brutally murdered. And I won't be able to hear him coming with this rain. I think that's food right there. Please be food. Chem lights? No, I don't see food. Gosh darn it. Uh, Alright. Next floor. Oh, that's a shotgun. Gosh darn it. Uh, I need food! I'm gonna starve to death. There is a grocery store nearby. That I can go to. It's in Berezino. 
It also has that hospital there, which also has the possibility of having a helicopter, so I'll head there next. It's a lot bigger town, and I'm going to have to deal with a lot more zombies. If I aggro them, I might be dead. Might be the last you ever hear me. There is actually is one more spot I want to check out. I want to check out Os Alsha. Alsha is just to the northeast of the airfield, which it might have some food there as well. I'm not sure. What is that? Looks weird. I never noticed that before. Is that some sort of something on the ground? Huh. I'll investigate. I wonder if I could go back and take that sand barrier. That would be kind of nice to carry with me. I mean, I don't really have a purpose for it, but that's the first time I've ever seen one. Hmm. Uh, food's probably more important right now than finding that sandbag. And I'm going to be going back into trouble if there is someone back there. I didn't see anyone. Doesn't mean they're not there. I think it's just that wood, those pallets there is what I saw. What I can do is I can run back up uh, to uh, Al Alsha. It's right up here. I'll visit there real quick, and then I'll come back to the airfield. It's a risk, but... Is that an animal? Oh, it's a boar! Yes. I can get some food. I think they have something like five meat on them. don't really see a whole lot of them. You always find the animals when you don't have a hunting knife, and then when you do have a hunting knife and a box of matches, you never find them. It's like they're hiding. It's like they know. They know you're coming for them. I wonder how long this, this boy has been surviving. How many days? It's been out of here. I can't look! Oh, I don't know if I killed it or not. Oh, oh it's still alive. Alright, let me try one more time. Nope. This is one thick ball. Or thing. Not ball. Oh, I got it. Alright, it's dead. In the tree. Actually, probably a good place to go after I shot like 10,000 bullets. It has four raw meat on it, so that's another thing to to uh, to look for. Is um, I'm not sure where I was going to go with that. Actually, I'm going to put that in there and continue to take the meat. There's two, three. Oops. Where'd it go? Four. This should be all of it. And there goes the body. Thank you, Mr. Bourne. I'll never forget you. Let's see if I can find a safe place to put a, a tent. Uh, not a tent. Um, a fireplace. Real quick. Now I go ahead and make the fireplace. Oh, I can make it right here. Sweet. I thought this would be too much of a, a decline in the hill. It'd be it'd be too uneven. But light the fire. Cook the meat. Presto change or we have no cooked meat. Okay. Get the fire out. Hoping it'll run into another animal. Okay, yeah, remove the fireplace. And Ta-da! It's gone. Where did it go? It's not up this sleeve. It's not up this sleeve. I can't find it. Alright, I'm drink. No, I have food. I'm eating my food. I need to get my blood back. Uh, okay, I just ate three out of my four. My blood is up to 8,000 now. Go ahead and put this in my backpack, save it for later. Okay, alright. 
Oops. I'm gonna press the button. Let's check my compass. Too bad. I have the G17, but I don't think the flashlight on this works. This is on some weapons that you can use the flashlight on, maybe? I'm not sure what it is. I think it's L that you press. That's the default key to use the... To use the, uh... The flashlight. I think is what it is. Yeah, the flashlight. Alright. Sometimes there are zombies up here, but I heard you can find supplies here as well. Yeah, there's a zombie. And there's another. And I thought that was a human up there. It doesn't look right for some reason. I was up there the other day. Hmm. Let's keep going. Somebody said that they found a vehicle over here. I'm going to check it out. I'm doing okay on water. I have all those cans. really just mostly need food right now. Something to eat. Uh... I think I'm off course, actually. Heading northeast. Should be putting me there. Should be seeing the town by now. Probably because it's rainy and foggy, so... Probably. Uh-oh. Is that me? I don't want chasing me. Maybe not. Uh... Weird. Alright. Is that another one right there? Oh, that's a rock. Look like a boar. Same size as the one. You can't eat rocks, I've tried. I don't taste very good either. They're not good for your teeth. Now here's the town I'm looking for. This is Ol Olsha, I think. That's how it's pronounced. Ol Olsha, right there. I think I'm gonna go along the coast, maybe. I don't know. I'm trying to find the boat. I don't know where I went. So here's this really small town. It's just north east of that airfield. I wonder if I can spot anything with my binoculars. I don't really want to go into the town. If you can see it with the binoculars, it's a little bit safer. Looks like you can actually go inside that house. Hmm. I mean, is the door closed? Let's see if I can get into a different position. What is that? Oh, it's a house. Let's see, what is that weird looking thing right there? You can usually tell if it's a house that you can go in because the windows will be clear. You can actually see inside. This is the porch. I don't see anything there. I think you can actually search trash cans. I'm not sure though. Go ahead and head up here. It'd be nice if it, when it was raining that it would decrease the chances of a zombie hearing and seeing you. I'm not sure if it does. I haven't really paid attention to that. If you know, if you've seen it, let me know. I'm thinking it does to some degree. At least it'd be kind of interesting. It'd give you a little bit more of a chance you could sneak in here a little bit more. Be undetected. I don't really see any vehicles. I see the uh, static ones. I don't see actual real vehicles that we can use. Because usually, sometimes you can find one here. I think. Don't crawl. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's a crawler. I can easily avoid him. I don't think he saw me. Hmm, weird. See anything down there? I sort of supplies. Probably head back to the airfield, but um, I think probably the supplies have respawned now or changed, possibly. So I need to go back this way. I'm gonna head back this way, and then I'm gonna go to Barzino. Get over here. Hopefully there's no one else hidden here. We won't speak any other language besides English though. 
It makes it a little bit more difficult when you, you play on European servers like this. When it's daytime and it's actually nighttime where you're from, and if you're from the US. Because you can't see where you're going. Wait, what? That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, because it'd be dark on those servers. You can actually see where you're going on these. You wouldn't be able to on a, like a US server right now, unless you had night vision goggles. Oh, jeez. That was kind of scary.